Hello everyone, welcome back to the Gold Technical Analysis session with Mukmik. So, how have you been doing? Did you have a great weekend? I did myself and I hope you did too. So, happy Monday and we are ready for trading. What happened to the chart was really interesting and I do need to explain that to you. So, that's the new knowledge I guess. So, let's get started. Alright, so... So here is the shots. If you remember on Friday, I did not delete any plans that we planned together here. So we had the selling plan at 1756 to 1759. However, the price did not really hit this selling plan. Why is that? There's the reason behind that because if you remember when we made the plan together, we were at this candlestick. Alright, so around 3 p.m. Thai time. So I use my Fibonacci retracement and what we've got here is the QM sale. However, the price did not really return to you know make a sale order there and it makes a lower low here. So this is the case that you need to update the swing yourself. So if you update the swing, you will get the order okay so our entry point is at 61.8 to 78.6 okay so if you know how to update the swing you will have a sell order here at around 1755 you will get the order okay so that's done if you haven't got the order it's fine we will have a new plan together anyway okay so it's a new day let's remove all the drawings from the friday and also a new week so we need to look into the weekly time frame okay so in the weekly time frame we came up to taste this supply zone in the weekly time frame okay however the price did bounce back from this support okay so it used to be a resistant once the price crossed this resistance and closed as a bullish one really big green candlestick it will turn itself into a support okay so at this moment the gold price is now being in the deciding state whether it is going to trust this support or is it going to trust this supply zone okay so that's the weekly time frame okay do we have another supply zone yes actually we have this supply zone here as well okay do we have the demand zone yes we do it's pretty far away so we're not gonna use it very soon okay so let's drop down to the daily time frame oh so in the daily time frame we have the doji candlestick as i said it is still in the deciding phase for the gold okay so we are still having our demand zone here and the supply zone there so it's going to be roughly the same border as the weekly time frame okay do we have anything more on the daily time frame nope so i'll drop down to the four hours time frame all right so in the four hours time frame we have our demand zone here formed from the friday uh demand zone okay do we have the supply zone yes we do so we have the supply zone here Shoop. what else that we've got so the thing that we've got is this QM pattern, okay? So let me change the lines. So if we have the QM pattern because the price making a higher high than this one, I'll use my Fibonacci retracement again. And oh, beautiful. So our entry point is going to be here from 17. 40 roughly so that's the significant number as well to 1734 
Okay, so we have the buying plan here. What about the selling plan? So for the selling plan, let me check. So it is going to be in the one hour time frame. So we have our supply zone here in the four hours time frame, right? And we also have this supply zone in the one hour time frame as well. But the thing is, I have this pattern for you. It's the low twice. So we could be waiting somewhere up there. So let me use my Fibonacci extension. Uh, which one is the lowest low? Okay, so the red one. All right, so first plan for selling is at 1760. Okay, and the second plan is going to be at 1766 roughly. Okay, so that's for this pattern, but you need to wait for the price to coming back up. Okay, so the first plan is going to be at 1760. You can separate it into two different plans or you can include them, you know, into one, only one plan, but you need to reduce your lot size because it's going to be quite a large uh, range from there, okay? So we have the two selling plans here for you and one buying plan there. So. I hope it's easy to understand and I hope you learned something new from this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. And also, please click the subscribe button for us. Thank you very much. And also, <laughs> the second also, okay, if you want to join me in the BUBI project, you can do so by register on our website and we'll let you in on our Telegram. It's the confirming you know, signal that we will confirm you through our telegrams. So I'll see you in there and see you tomorrow. Bye.